Hi guys, it's Jamie and I'm here with my August favorites. I'm a little late filming this, which I apologize. Um, I did want to show you what I've been loving this month though. Uh, but I wanted to talk about for one minute, um, just like housekeeping. Um, oh, and by the way, please don't pay attention to what I look like. I've been running errands literally nonstop all day. It's so hot outside. I barely put any makeup on this morning. I just put it on enough to like not scare people. You know what I'm talking about? Um, and I've been like on the go all day and it's like the end of the day I'm getting ready to go pick up the baby um from daycare school sorry calling it school uh because she's learning so much anyway uh so I wanted to just say that work has been insane for me like it is for everybody I know but it's been our busy season and it gets so intense I've been getting there early every day um and so when I get home at night between being exhausted and um you know having Vivi here I haven't really haven't been able to get online really and answer comments back to videos but please know that I read them all I appreciate all of you taking the time to do that and please don't think that I'm being rude or I'm a jerk um, it's just hectic and uh, the last thing I, I can do at night when I can barely keep my eyes open is like get on get on the computer when I've sat in front of one all day so you know I know everybody's busy blah 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 but I just wanted to mention that um, let's move on to my favorites. I have them on my phone. I did want to point out I got the giant iPhone. This is a 6S. I know they just came out with a 7, um, which I don't need the latest and greatest, but it is. I was going to get a new phone last year on December 14th, which was a Sunday. Um, and yeah, I ended up having a baby on that day. So I've been meaning to get a phone finally got one. Um, I like how big it is and I think it'll be good for Vivi. Uh, when we're out and about she can watch little Peppa the Pig videos. <laughs> anyway, okay let's get on to my favorites which I think I've been like twirling around. This Bobbi Brown Beach Rollerball. I love it. First of all, Bobbi Brown Beach, one of my favorite perfumes for the summer of all time. Um, this was a gift from my friend Mindy last year on my birthday. And since my birthday is August 20th, I got it at the end of the summer. I think I used it like twice and then put it up. So look how much I've used this summer. Like that's a lot. Um, I've kept it in my purse and I've just been like refreshing. I just refreshed so I don't want to like do a double double dose. But um, I have been loving this. And I'm not hugely into rollerballs. Like I like little like sprays instead. But for some reason this rollerball is fabulous and I love it. Alright, um, second thing, I'll just go ahead and mention it because I'm wearing it over top of a nude. I probably should have put some color on today, but this NARS lip gloss, it is not new to me. Um, it is Super Vixen, and it is like this beautiful bronzy color, and it is great by itself. I've talked about this like a bunch of times on this channel, and I'm wearing it today over like a nude lipstick. I love it. Um, it's a good one. It's a good one, and I've had this... I think she's over a year old. I think I got her, like, not this last April, but the one before that. I can't remember. But I love it. It's fabulous. It's been a staple. It's just one of those eat. Sorry, I can feel my hair. Okay, I've been wearing my hair in a ponytail or a bun for so long that having my hair down, I'm like, oh, it's touching me. <laughs> you know what I mean? And then I'm touching it. Annoying. Okay. Uh, next thing, I don't think I've ever talked about this on my channel. Uh, the Dr. Dennis Gross, this is the Instant Radiant Sun Defense. Um, I got the light medium, it has SPF 40. I have been wearing this every day. I got this in July, and it was like one, like a one item purchase at Sephora, so I didn't like do a haul. And I've been meaning to talk about, like, look how dirty she is. Uh, I love this. It's one of those glow lotions that everyone seems to be loving this summer. And it just like rubs in. Sorry, I just did that. You couldn't even see it. I don't want to waste her, but it just looks like um, it just looks like a light, like a foundation color, but it's not a foundation. Don't, like, don't get it confused. It's not a foundation. It does say sheer color correction technology, which I agree. So it just kind of rubs in, and I'll be honest with you. In the store, I could see it. The first time I used it, I was like, "Am I glowy? Like, I don't understand how this works." Uh love it like I gave it more than one try obviously I've been using it like you know what like I love it and just gives a nice glow like a radiant look that's what it is it's not shimmer it's not shimmer 
and it's not like sparkle it's just glowy and um i think they had one that was darker which i didn't get i had, don't tan my face and haven't really been in the sun much you know a lot this year but um i have loved this and what i love about it is that it has spf 40 so some days especially like on the weekends or when i go to the pool um i would just do my regular like moisturizer like whatever and then i'd come back and like this was the makeup i used just this i just felt like i didn't want anything but just a little like radiance and this has done that and i have enjoyed this so much i wish i'd found this in the early like spring summer instead of july but i just i love this stuff it's fabulous okay um this next thing i got i will say i got this in the middle of august so i've only been using it for a couple weeks um but i can already tell you i love it it was a gift for my friend kristen game here on youtube um i know all of you that watch me are already subscribed to her but just in case you're not you need to go over and subscribe to her she makes excellent videos and she puts them up regularly can you say that word jamie regularly uh, anyway, um, it's the Giorgio Armani Eyes to Kill, and it is this silk eyeshadow, and I love it. You guys know I like stuff in pots. Like, don't get me started. The Dior uh, Fusion Monos um, are some of my favorites, but look at this. This is the shade, it's the champagne shade. I think it's number eight. Look at it. Oh my goodness. Now I am wearing, you probably can't see it, I am wearing like a light, um, a very light dusting of it, you know, on my eyes today. But it looks like, it's like rose gold champagne and like a little bit of like silvery color. She's stunning. She's beautiful. Very easy to work with. Look at that shine. Oh, yes. She said she wanted me to have one of these and that she knew that, like this was one of my like favorite colors and it really is. I love these types of shades. And I didn't use um primer today. I just like threw it on, so it's very light. Uh and it, it is sparkly. Love it. Need to see what other colors are out there. Um I don't think they sell our money near me, maybe in Saks, but I, let's be honest. Girl doesn't go to Saks. Um, unless it's like to get a gift for someone or something. So, loving that. And then this baby, I hauled this in my last Ulta haul. It's the Laura Geller Baked Sculpting Bronzer and Highlighter Palette. I got Porcelain Fair, which is really light. Normally I wouldn't get this. But I've been loving it. I've been sticking to this side a lot more and just, you know, just using it kind of like this. I've already done this today. And like almost like an all over powder and I just feel like it just wakes me up. I feel like this helps giving me like a wake up, wake up look. It warms my skin just a tiny bit. Um, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. That's how I've been using it. I have used the highlighter separately which I like. Um, but that's how I've been wearing it and I've really enjoyed having this. And when I bought this I was like, do you really need this? You should consider taking this back. Love it. Um, and then the last thing I believe, I don't even know if they sell this. This was a couple years old. Vaseline Cocoa Butter Revi no, Vitalizing Gel Body Oil. I have been hitting the, bo hitting the bottle big time this summer. Um, I love this. A little goes a long way. Um, it does leave your skin with an oily feel. So just to let everyone know, it's not really like the um, Neutrogena body oil that I love gosh I need to go to this next um like the light sesame this goes this sinks in this does not um I use this after a bath or shower before bed um I make sure if it goes on my feet I put socks on because she might be slippery and I put pants on and I put a, a you know night pants or whatever I don't mind it because I have dry skin and I like the way it feels I like the way it smells um I don't know if they have this I meant to look at Target recently I do know they have something similar for babies um, like a baby body gel um, by Vaseline so I don't know I have just been I've been loving this stuff and yeah she's oily but I like it I like it a lot all right that's everything oh one more little thing this is so small and maybe silly uh, I saw it at the our Hallmark Hallmark store it's a little Yankee candle and it's the sun and sand and it's like the small like little diffuser thing. Is that what they're called? Um, 
This is my favorite scent by Yankee Candle. And I just love the look of it. It's a beach scene. See how pretty that is? And it sits in my bathroom. And it's just light and nice. And it just puts a very light fragrance in the air. It's not overwhelming. Sometimes, because she's getting down to like this much, sometimes I'm like, I can't really smell it that much. And I think the box said you could flip the reeds um, so that the wet is, you know, up top and like that's how you can refresh them it was like $9.99 I actually went in to get another one and they were sold out and so they weren't getting any more um, but I really enjoyed these this little thing and this scent I'm ready for fall but I'm not ready to give up my sun and sand my beachy scents I'm just not I just they're addicting um, anyway thank you so much for watching I'd love to know what some of your favorites have been uh, for the month of August sorry it's so late um, I hope you guys are having a great September so far and um, I will be back with another video very soon thank you so much for watching bye